In 797, in the city of Constantinople, Empress Irene is arguing with her son, Constantine VI. She blames him for his many failings and his ability to stoke division. Division like the iconoclasm, a war on religious icons that had plagued the empire. Irene had chosen the side that venerated the holy images, while Constantine demanded their destruction throughout the empire. Constantine, ever the divider, decided to add fuel to this fire by divorcing his wife, the granddaughter of a saint, and chose to marry his mistress instead. This caused major instability within a church that was already alarmingly fractured and threatened to cause a major schism. So Irene did what any loving mother would do in such times. She seized power. With the help of the imperial court, they overthrew Constantine and crowned Irene as the new emperor. She ended the iconoclasm, stabilized the empire, and when Constantine tried to escape, she had him dragged back home to be blinded and imprisoned within his palace. After his death, he was buried in a monastery that Irene had had built, likely surrounding her son with many icons.